better. This one has a nice contrast on the points. I have another one here. This one's fancy. It has a map design on the case, which is very nice. It's sort of a world traveler kind of color scheme on the inside. Another traditional material is wood. Here I have a very nice walnut set with a design in the veneer on the front. On the inside, which is held closed by magnets, you can see that there are wooden points, wooden pieces, as opposed to the plastic pieces that are in the leather leatherette sets. This one happens to also have wooden cups, which is kind of nice. For a more modern looking set, you could go with one with a nice suede or velvet. This one here is a deep emerald green. And on the inside, it's a beautiful dark black green with very high contrast on the points. It's a nice piece, very soft. Makes a nice sound when you roll the dice, which is an important, an important assessment of a good backgammon board that it sounds nice when you roll the dice on it. The most modern one we have here is a metal attache case. It's uh, been very popular lately. It's kind of James Bond looking. Poker chip sets are often sold in a case like this. On the inside it has a a velvet padded interior similar to the rest and has a nice soft surface for rolling the dice onto. As you can see they come in a variety of, of shapes and styles and mostly what makes a fancy chess set is how the outside looks and also uh, what sort of padding and points are on the inside. And it's fancy backgammon sets.